Hello guys and welcome back to my channel for this week episode I would like to show you how you can paint uh, plastic, any plastic in a proper way and for my the Udamas project I will uh, like to have a sunglass support which I ordered from a scrapyard here in Romania it was costing 34 lays so I, need, I receive it like it is I will open it okay and this one I would like to make it blue and this blue um, have some metallic face inside I would like to explain you a little bit about the product that um, I will use and uh, which, which is the best way to paint any plastic because there are on the market paints that are directly for plastic so it's a flexible coat that uh, have a um, a really good bonding between uh, the paint and the plastic but you are somehow limited to some colors like black white uh, a, a blue but a normal blue not a, a metallic one that's why uh, to avoid this i will use for first uh, plastic primer which is acrylic uh, plastic primer and this have a very good bonding between the plastic and the primer. After that I will use the desired color of the paint which is a blue metallic paint and to have a, a good protection for of the paint of the blue paint I will use a clear lake spray and because this uh, support will be very often push it up and down up and down and for sure the paint will be damaged but if I apply the Prior, uh, the clear lake uh, spray then the paint will resist for a very long time that's it with the product now um, I would like to tell you a little bit about the tip before to start this project uh, and actually the paint I will uh, clean this with alcohol and also all this can I will put them in a bucket where I will put hot water between 20 to 30 degrees and I will leave them for about 10 minutes because in this way the paint inside will dilute a little bit and you'll have a better better uh, result so the paint will have better properties other thing is that uh, when you put the can in the water for example this one it's uh, uh, has a paper uh, label so it's better to put it in a plastic bag and then to put it in a bucket with water. Why that? Because all this will get wet even if you try to uh, dry it with a paper towel then some drops of water will remain on the can and then it might be possible to go uh, down on your paint job which uh, for sure you don't want this but I can tell you this from my experience because that was happening to me in the past. Okay I will put this in a bucket and then I will uh, start applying the paint. As I said, I put all my can in a plastic bag because they have a paper label and I don't, I don't want that to be wet. And I will leave it here in the hot water for around 10 minutes. And this time the paint inside it will uh, dilute a little bit and the viscosity will decrease. So the paint job will, uh, will have better results. Another very important aspect is to prepare the um, plastic or the area you want to paint before the paint job and this is by covering all the parts that you don't want to be paint with some adhesive tape as I've made here and clean everything very good with alcohol this can be a tedious job but uh, take care or pay attention to the details because this can make a huge difference between a very good and quality paint job and um, paint job that looks to be made with no experience okay now I cover everything I will clean all the surface with alcohol Now it's ready. 
ready to be painted. Another very important aspect is um, after your uh, paint cans stay in the water for around 10 minutes, then it's very important to mix the paint for one minute. So you just shuffle the can for one minute. That will make a huge difference uh, in your paint job. Okay, so now uh, my cans are ready to be used and I will start by applying the first layer of um, plastic primer. I also recommend use, a use some protection or latex gloves. Okay, now we let this uh, thin layer to dry for approximately 30 minutes and then we are going to proceed with the uh, paint color. Okay, so the, pri the plastic primer already uh, has dry and now I will start applying the paint. The color paint. When you apply the color, try not to apply a very thick layer. So it should be recommended to apply in two, three layers until you have an homogeneous color, but not too thick in some space where you can apply from first row. Because if you are doing that, then um, it will happen that some paint will be very thick in some places and then it will start to leak. Now, now I will let the first layer to dry for approximately 30 minutes and then I will come back and apply the second one. The paint has set for 30 minutes, so it's already dry. That's why I will start with the last layer.
okay the last layer has been applied as well now I'll wait this uh, to dry for 30 minutes and then I will apply the clear leg and that should be everything for today okay guys now 30 minutes later I will apply the clear leg being the last layer and the protective one I will let it dry for 30 minutes and then I will come back and I will show you how it's the final result. Okay guys, this is the final result after the clear lake has been dry. From my point of view, um, the result is very satisfying. I mean the color is uniform. And um, yeah. If you find this uh, video helpful, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, that will uh, help me very much continue. And stay tuned until next time. Thank you very much.